Uh, we're gonna take a moment just to show you this brand new Century 5130. There's a full functioning remote, operates the underlift, boom, winches, nice feature. It's handheld, has its own charging dock inside the uh, chassis. And if uh, you were to accidentally leave it on the job, it'll uh, have a warning light in the dash. This particular model we upgraded, it has the D-rings on the feet, on the towel board. This also has LED work lights on the underlift and roller guides for the safety chains to make it easy in and out of the safety chain pockets. It has uh, the tailgate dress-up kit. It also has the flex lights on the side. These are nice. It gives you good clear vision from the cab so you know where the rear of the wrecker is when you're backing up. A lot of storage in this. Also has the tailgate underlift control. You really don't even have to uh, open up the toolbox doors to operate this. This particular one also has the 7035 what they call upgrade for the underlift. It gives you a little bit more reach. If you notice the Sentry has opposing jack legs. The jack legs come down on an angle. It gives you a better stance and recovery situation, side pulls. This keeps the wrecker a little more stable. This is Sentry's new tail lights too. These are really sharp. Got a nice look to them. There's a power lock switch inside which unlocks and locks the, the wrecker's door. When you're all done with the job, you can either use that switch or a key fob. The new control station is made out of poly so that you don't have any rust. It's a little bit lighter. There's an hour meter. You can use that uh, when you're for the maintenance scheduling. Your throttle up is back here. Two-speed winches, winch releases. Gauges for your tension on the cable tensioners. It's storage for the tow light and it's charging in this uh, station here. This one also has the airline trailer ball adapter with multiple balls. It also has uh, LEDs and all the and all the toolbox lighting. A lot of frame forks. There's more forks on the other side there. This is kind of a unique thing. This, you can put your pry bar, uh, broom. You know, just uh, keeps keeps the long stuff right. Put it inside there and uh, keeps everything kind of neat and organized. It also upgraded that light pylon. This is kind of neat. It's a little reminiscent of old school. It has uh, the tiers on there, so you can add the pods. It just layers the light bars so it gives a little bit nicer effect at night. This wrecker body has the LED body lights all over it and it has a strobe module in there to it turns all the marker lights into gives it that strobe effect. Brand new Kenworth T800 with a small bunk. The Miller spec chassis. They do a wonderful job on the spec. Over the years they've really really grown Tried to, to make it fit uh, fit everybody. You know, horsepower, transmissions. There's more frame forks here. Mini fifth wheel, kennel. It's really nice. This LED lighting is a great feature inside this. Nice lighting at night. You know, not a lot of shadowing. There's your chain rack. These are all power locks too. So when you're done with your recovery job or just you press the key fob or that lock like we showed you in the back. Dual controls. You can uh, get more information on Lynch Chicago's website or call one of your salesmen here at Lynch Chicago, 708-233-1112. Thanks for uh, looking at uh, Lynch Chicago.